everybody, Ken Pierce here. Hang on just a minute, I'm gonna fix my slice right here. Uh, yep, there we go, slice fixed. Uh, pretty silly, huh? One little random exercise is gonna fix my slice. Well, you know, I saw a, uh, in a publication, actually it was on, um, on the internet, and there was a video, and it was, well, first it was titled, This Exercise Will Fix Your Slice. And so I had to watch it, and basically that's what they were doing, and it was just upright rows with leaning on a balance ball. And I, I, I kind of got infuriated because a random exercise like that will never fix your slice. That's not gonna happen. You know, you I've got hundreds of these from hundreds of these from years and years and years, and you can open up any one of these golf magazines or golf, any sort of golf magazine, and you're gonna find tips that are gonna help you play better. Some of them you're gonna pick up and go, wow, that makes sense, I'll do that. Some of them you're gonna say, I don't get it, and so you won't ever practice it. And that's my whole purpose about random exercises and random drills and random, random, random is not gonna get you anywhere. Random equals nothing, nothing really down the road, nothing. Random, what you wanna do is get a little bit specific, but also something that's comfortable for you to repeat and repeat and repeat over and over and over. Let me give you a quick story. A fella came into, um, into our office and he had purchased uh, uh, some of our products before and he wanted to get our new Power Swing Plus. And uh, we started on a, on a conversation about things and he was telling me that as far as fitness goes, he's, you know, he doesn't want to get up and he, the, the, those kinds of things. And he said, you know, I, I go and I play and I practice a lot and it, it works for me. And I said, that's great. And then he said, but you know, one thing, I, and I mentioned to him, I said, you look like you lost weight since the last time I talked to you. And he, he went, wow, you, great you noticed. But yeah, what I do is I get up every single morning. Every single morning I get up and I ride my bike, my road bike. I ride it uh, uh, at around 10 miles every single day. And I said, wow, 10 miles every single day, that's amazing. He said, yep, I get up every morning and I do it and, and that's what helps me and, and on and on and on about this road bike in the morning, every single morning for 10 miles minimum 10 miles. And so th there was a little bit of a interesting juxtaposition of him saying, well, you know, I don't really want to do that much to, to, for fitness kind of thing, but, but yet he grabbed on and, and locked into something that he really loved, the road bike in the morning. He started seeing results and he loved it and then he got into it and it became a habit and he continued to do that. That's the kind of thing that this golf fitness thing is all about. Just real quickly here, if you look at all the pros, especially right now, while I'm, the time I'm shooting this video, they're showing all these things and pictures about Rory McIlroy, you know, a, a deadlifting 9,000 pounds, I don't know what it is. But anyway, they're showing all these pictures of Rory McIlroy doing all these heavy weights. Well, people that lock onto that say, well, they do it, I guess I gotta get into it. Well, the thing is, they're doing it because if their bodies are more stable and they can hit the ball a little bit farther, they can make a gazillion dollars doing that. That's not our deal. But, so all I wanna say to you is, is be careful about just doing random exercises. They're gonna be boring and also won't get you motivated to do any more. So, and I'm gonna encourage you to uh, look at the Golf Gym website and just check out the videos that we have on there. Not everything is using our products, but it, it's something to help you just get started, like the three minute videos. Three minutes, that's it. Three minute exercises in the morning, th or three minute workouts, I mean. Um, three minutes in the morning, or in the afternoon, or in the evening, or any time. Those kinds of things, if you can do consistently, will help you to get going a little bit closer to where an exercise like this may in fact help you to be more stable and may in fact eventually help you to eliminate your slice. But let me get back to this, specific. Get specific about the kinds of things you wanna do. Check out all things, but then go to the things that actually get you motivated to wanna be habit, to create, I mean, wanna create a habit about it. So. That's it for today, I just wanted to tell you, random exercises and drills are not gonna fix your golf game. They're gonna help your golf game possibly, but you're gonna lose interest and you're not gonna get into a habit of it. So what, I, what we do here at Golf Gym is, 
we think that if you play better, you're going to enjoy the game more. And if you enjoy the game more, you're going to play better. So I encourage you, please subscribe to our videos. There's a button right up here. And then go down here to go to golfgym.com to see what I've been talking about. <laughs> and we will see you on the next video.